Hello everyone. In today's tutorial, we'll be learning how to do this. Now this is actually a frame. In Canva, you do find frames and I don't mean the usual kind of frames. This is a different kind and I'll show you what I mean. So they have this new one now where it's uh, colorful and it surrounds the image. So to start off with, we will add a page and we will go to elements and we'll look search for frame and you have to put it at all if you put it at photos it's only going to show you the frame you know uh, photos and graphics you need to put all and these are the frames now the usual ones are like this you know insert this and then you take a photo you know it could be any photo so let's say I take a cat okay and then you have to move it till it's in here now you can adjust this you double click it and you can move it now if the photo is this dimension you cannot decrease it but you can enlarge it okay? so let's say it's there and then you move it and it's done it looks like a, a real, like you know, those days when you had a photo. See, you can see the, the border. Okay, let's say you don't want this. So you can either delete the whole thing or right click it, detach the image. And you just move it aside. This one you can delete. And go back to elements and you look for frame. So just now you look for frame, right? So it's still there. And there's so many ways you can choose any of these. You can choose that. And you move it till you, it's in there, you know? So this is extremely easy. Now they have a, a new one that I discovered. I did not find this earlier. So if you sc scroll all the way, well, not all the way, but quite a ways down, I'm doing right now. now you have all these different ones like a compass um, all you have to do is click it bring it in there and you can see the different um, ways the, this can be done now you also have like this where you can choose different photos for example this one can go in that one you can choose another one um, let's go to Again, let's choose another one. Let's just choose something from here, even though it says. Let's go to photos. Let's choose this one. And it's in there. So you can choose, you know, what you want. So that's another way of doing it. Okay, so double click, detach, move down. So we go back to frame again, this time again, go to all, and let's scroll down to the one that was up here. So just keep scrolling. You have heart shape, you have all the different kinds, there's like a puzzle piece here, and you have frames with flowers. This looks like a scarab. What that looks like. As if it's a window with curtains, clouds, many, many different frames that you can choose. Pineapple. So this is the one that I chose here. So all you do is just click it and then you can adjust it. You can just leave it this way and then insert the photo and then adjust it as well. So you do this now you just have to be a bit careful because sometimes when you are doing this what it does is oops it's gone so we go back to photos okay this one we'll drag it it's in here now you don't have to drag it you can just click it and it goes in here okay then you just adjust and it's there so then what you can do is this. 
fill in the frame, adjust it. And you can adjust this as well, like I mentioned before, you can move this here, there. You cannot, if that's the size, you cannot reduce the size, you can enlarge. So in this case, that's fine. We'll just adjust him. There you go. It's very simple. You can do it for so many other frames as well. I mean, if, if you want to adjust it here itself, all you have to do is just Detach the image, just move it down. And as long as there's nothing in here, you can just delete it. Okay? And you go back to frame and you can choose anything else that you want. Um, let's do another one. Let's see what else they have here. Let's choose this one. Let's see how that looks. Okay? Take this. There you go. It and you can see the outline there, right? Budget. Now you can change the color of this, the, the red, the maroon. Um, you want to blue, blue, light blue. It's up to you what you want to do. Okay, so this is how easy it is. Um, I did have a query saying how, how would you do these frames and this is how you do it. Now, let me just show you one other thing. Let's just move this here. Okay. Now this one, where there's a hole in the middle. And I'll show you how that is. That will turn up. Okay. It's fairly simple. I'm sure you know already, but... And there you go. So you can perhaps insert your text. Or something like that. I mean, this is more of a design thing than anything else, really. So when you scroll down, there's so there's so many. You can even um, look at this. It's like a dragon. It's amazing the number of designs they've got here. And it's really good to, to differentiate yours from, from everyone else's out there when you put it in these kind of frames. You've got the plastic ones, you've got all these different ones. You've got, you, 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 I mean, you've also got numbers if you want to put in numbers, uh, alphabets. Basically, they have even in a picture. Oh, that's cute. Okay, let's let's just do that. Okay, I'll just move this, delete that, and let's put him in there. There you go. Double click, move him in bed. Now the other option is okay, let me detach it. Okay, bring it down here. You can adjust this first. And put it in there. So, you know, like I said, it's uh, we so many options. So anyway, I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please do um, like, subscribe, comment. Um, let me know if you need if you want to see something else, and yeah, hit the bell notification so that when I do um, put out another video, you'll be notified. Thank you.